Hello, beloved. Peace be unto you. I've been meditating on um, John 2, where Jesus turned water into wine. And the part that um, I find interesting always is the part where his mother um, said to the servant, whatever he tells you to do, do it. Now that is known, um, Jesus turning water in the, into wine is known as his first miracle in the New Testament. You ever wondered why Mary was so confident? Why she was able to say, listen, whatever he tells you to do, no matter what it is, just do it. Because she has experienced, as his mother, she had experienced his supernatural abilities. She knew, she knew what her son was capable of. There's another story that says that she, she pondered things in her heart. As Jesus was growing up and things were happening, I think it was when he said that he was about his father's business at 12 years old. And the word of God says, she ponders these things in her heart. Remember, the angels appeared to her. The angel had told her about who this young boy, her son, is to be. So it was no slight things, slight thing, or just one of those things. It has a great impact in terms of what Mary said, whatever he tells you to do, just do it. Today I'm telling someone, God has spoken to you in private. He has furnished you in the bed of affliction. You have gone through the fiery furnace. You have gone through trials and tribulations, struggles and challenges, and you are prepared. You are prepared for your public ministry. So whatever Holy Spirit is telling you to do, do it. It will be backed. It will be approved. It will be sanctioned and promoted by the Holy Spirit himself, by power, by authority. Whatever he tells you to do, go ahead and do it. Stop questioning, stop doubting, stop finding all kind of excuse why, why it won't work. Why it will work, what's going to happen, what people going to say. Stop. Whatever the Lord tells you to do, just do it. He's the same God yesterday, today, and forever. And he's the same God that has worked many miracles in your life. So now he's telling you, to do it. You are ready. Stop doubting yourself. God is with you. Your faith in him can never, never fail. There's no risk in faith. <laughs> There's no risk whatsoever in faith. You can bank on it. You can count on it because God cannot fail himself. Have a blessed day.